at the point of isolation. So if I actually put this onto amps and I go onto the line conductor, I see I've got 11 amps on the line, I've got on the neutral, I've got 4.8. So there's a share in my current. That means that there's a parallel path back due to the PME and that is in my bonding. So you've got to check for any potential parallels going through your protective conductors. Now, if we were to remove that, there may be a little spark. So we've got to be aware of this. This is why these may need to be insulated now. But then that current will then go straight back to the neutral and then 100% will be on line and neutral. If, however, your neutral is broken, you'll now have none of this current on your neutral. And this is all going to be here in your earthing conductor to your main earthing terminal okay well actually in this case it's going through here to there it's not going that way